Hi, <coughs> today we will go through the um, Illustrator AAS plugin workflow. Um, the first thing you have to do is you go to Setup Printers. Um, if I have a Dragua, for example, you need to right click on the mouse, select Properties, and go to Advanced, and select the second one over here just select this one and then OK then the next thing you have to do is get our JavaScript for AAS registration setting and copy this file is about 19 KB so what you have to do you go to um, you see over here I install on the D drive so you put on the D drive program file So we're going to D drive, program file, Adobe, and then I have a CS3 right now, so um, I select Illustrator CS3, then you go a file called preset, preset, and then after preset, you go to script, that's, that's a file called script, and then what you need to do is copy the JavaScript on the script area, just copy to there. You see, after install, you open the CS3 program for Illustrator. So, uh, I have created a file. So, um, I'm using a multi layer file. It's called file, it's look like file. So, double click on the file. And here we are. So, the next thing I want you to do is go to file, set up the page size to be bigger. So um, I set to your so we set as this. We go to a uh, page size and I set millimeters. So um, the the width I set as 890 and then the height I set as 560 and I click OK and here we are. So the next thing to do is select everything on your objects then right click on the mouse select group after group everything then delete another layer we just left the the only one for that object so um, select everything over here and then on this step you go to windows I wish you to open some uh, function so you go to one two three four five the fifth one and the other one is the pen the pen over here so um, the next thing I want you to do is select the objects and only left the, the last one group everything and then pull down to the copy on the third one and then once you make the copy then what you need to do go to um, objects and there is there is a selection called path and you go offset I, I go again uh, object path and offset then I select as then I select as one millimeter and all use default and then we will see there is a lot of line over here a lot of line so what you need to do also select the first one which I just copy and then um, click on the file click on the window selection which uh, over here and uh, select the third one select the third one then you select over here if some other program you just select this one the first one otherwise you select over here select one of those and then select the first one and apply and you will see there's there's the file and after you combine you will see um, the contour line of set is coming then if you want to see the knife just like this the next thing you have to do you go to pen and set as remember this set as 0 0.001 and enter. Uh, once again, go to pen, 
the pen, pen width and set the 0 0.001 and enter ok we see the object again select the layer then we go to plane so you move the objects on I, I suggest over here I don't I don't suggest you over limit as the page size otherwise the registration map will be will be not appear so you select the objects and then you go to remember this you go to our uh, color mode set as RGB a uh, print for CMYK first so so we are making the AS marks go to file script and then you will see our AS registration setting then click on that one so four point is similar as code draw so we got four point zipper type and multi copy now I try to multi copy so I make four copy on the Y a uh, free copy on the X free copy on the Y and select the copy with outline and apply So after use uh, AS plugin, you will see we finished the multi copy. Then you go to print out. Just print up your job first. Okay. Then the next thing you have to do when you want to cut after you finish, the what you need to do is undo. Undo it. Undo it. Then uh, select the. Uh, just just select the layer with contour so I only select the first one as you see over here the graph is already gone so as this when you want to cut then select the object again and then select uh, the color mode change the color mode to RGB otherwise it won't read on the AS remember set uh, the color mode to RGB and after you set the RGB, then you go to uh, auto script, AS registration mark. Also make the same multi copy three, three by three, and copy with a line and apply. Remember move the objects, and don't over limit the the page. Otherwise, we will not the registration mark will not read it. So we go to Scrape and AS setting multi copy three by three and copy with all nine and apply. So here we are. Why we don't want the image inside the contour nine because it was it would take a lot of time. So we only need the contour nine comes out. So after all you finish over here, then you go to print and when you go to print there's my jogger for jog, jogger for 61 you can put anywhere you like then you select on the top one the top one is mean default by our cutting product and and then you're you're ready to go just click the plane the job file will coming up and there's a few things you may you have to make sure is the con the first thing is you only need to send the control now after print okay don't with the image otherwise it will take a lot of time for trans transfer and the second thing is always set the pen width as 0 0.001 and the first thing is when you mix the mark make sure it's within the page size not over if over it won't detect it so that's three things you, you need to mention so um, thank you for today if you have it